Welcome to west of Eden for a smooth start. Dive into the mooring line in the bay south of the dive site. Stay in shallow water while heading north for the first 10 minutes of your dive. You can find a lot of shrimp, moray eels and nudibranchs hiding in the coral. The sloping reef gradually gets steeper and you will start to see the large boulders of granite. Stay about 14 meters until you reach the Grand Canal. You can't miss it. At the entrance to this canyon you may be lucky enough to spot the harpoon manis shrimp. It usually resides inside a hole about 17 meters deep. She shares her home with other much smaller but very colorful shrimp, Thor's shrimp. Continue to plunge into the depths as you cross this channel. Directly at the end of this channel you can spot schools of eight-lined dwarf wrasse. By positioning yourself a few meters from them, you will be on the front line to observe them. They emerge from their coral, circle around very quickly, stretch out their beautiful, colorful fins and then return to their original location. This dance of love, made to attract the attention of females, is very interesting to watch but you will need to be patient and skillful especially if you are hoping for a good photo. Gorgon in west of Eden at the end of the canal, turn right you will find huge gorgonians. Look carefully inside, tiny damselfish have made their home in this safe place. Continue your dive following the large boulders they will lead to the deepest part of the site. If your no decompression limit allows it, cross the sandbar to reach a new rock formation. It is in this deep end that you will find the most colorful corals and the most amazing underwater fauna. Indeed, around 30 meters, it is not uncommon to see ribbon mores and even antennas. Arrived at the barrel sponges, continue north while going up towards shallower water. At the northern end of the site, you will find a large overhang with a large air pocket inside. This part of the site is by far the best for finding giant antennas. You can finish your dive in the shallow waters to the north. There are a few caves and passages between 5 meters to 10 meters. Be careful in this part of the site because the surf can sometimes be surprising. If the current and the surf are too strong, don't get too close to the rocks and stay outside until you finish your dive by making your safety stop in the blue.